if you haven't heard of Laz's Fair, then you must be living under a rock. Because this guy's been pumping out crazy passes like Sanctus Absurdus, The Limit Does Not Exist, and FC on Unlucky Morpheus, all with DT. For those of you who do not know, this has been achieved by something called rake tapping. Basically, it's when you use your hand and your keyboard and you do a cheese grater maneuver as fast as possible. All right, so pretty much how it goes, this is what normal streaming looks like. Not too bad. Um, now with rake tapping, what we gotta do is just like a cheese grater, we just run our fingers along the keys really quick. Let me do that again. Uh, uh, 600 BPM. Basically, your finger bumps into this one and then goes into that one. And then both fingers kind of bump. So G and then G and H, then H. And then obviously if you're using all five, all four of your fingers, you're doing that multiple times and it overlaps. Pretty broken. Now, as you can imagine, Players have been pretty divided on this new playstyle. Some think it's a new experimental tapping method, which should be admired, whereas others think it's hardware abusing. One of the Osu devs, Apollo, even considered this as severe as touchscreen. Now there are some rumors going around that the use of rake tapping could get your account banned. A Twitter user by the name of Minusbet has made a Twitter post about this, and has also asked Peppy. Pretty much, he does consider this a foul play as it does abuse hardware. He does go on that he's not making a definitive call on it yet, but he does state that if it is negatively affecting the community, we will take action as required. Now, one of the key points from this is that Minuspet wants to spread awareness that you should use this at your own risk, as it might not be allowed in the future. Now, the big thing about this is how do we even detect that rake tapping happened in a play? Now, I'm sure a lot of you might be thinking, well, that should be pretty easy, you know, if you just make a code or software or something in Osu that can detect if inputs are happening at a certain speed. I just think that there's too much error that could happen from that. Now, I'm not saying that, you know, a normal player can just do 900 BPM or anything, but where do we draw the line? You know, if you accidentally triple tap or, I don't know, do some, you know, or accidentally jitter click on your keyboard, is that considered rake tapping? Well, back in my day when Freedom Diver did high tie three mod with touchscreen to get a 900 back in 2017, I am a little bit concerned that this might be a thing. Instead, it would just say rake tapping detected. In fact, Minus Bet has actually covered this really extensively, and I do have a developer background, so I would recommend that. I really enjoy that aspect of Osu where we really expand our inputs. You know, once upon a time, everyone used the mouse to click and aim, and then keyboard was introduced for that, and then we used the tablet to aim, and that became mainstream. Um, I know there's some pretty interesting tapping techniques where you have a keyboard underneath your table, or I know there's this one guy who uses drum kit to tap. I think that stuff is awesome. And just really exploring how else to play this, you know, simple game. With the implementation of laser happening soon and the four key presses that we're going to have, I think that experimentation is going to be only natural. But yeah, just wanted to share that with you. That's about it. See you.